Hi guys, how are you guys doing throughout the MCO period? Almost a month since the MCO started and I hope everybody is doing well, you know, stay home, stay safe. Um, today I want to talk about something uh, which related to Malaysian football. I want to discuss something about, um, not discuss, I mean I want to talk something about Malaysian Football League, Malaysian Football Club, you know, particularly. Um, because this season, I really see the efforts and uh, the ideas that have thrown in uh, from many football clubs in Malaysia, how they market themselves and how they promote themselves. You know, we always see videos, uh, especially from those European big clubs, when they launch their new kits, you know, all the video is incredible, right? When we see, we all feel like, wow, it's amazing. It's like big production video production you know from all of them so when we see this from our local Malaysian football club it's incredible you know particularly this season you know there's so many videos so many photos you know posted by the official club Facebook IG you know you'll see it even in YouTube it's incredible so the reason why I, I'm, I'm picking up this topic is because I see the changes I see the um, positive side, you know, of our Malaysian football club, you know, especially so many years after, you know, the struggle of financial, the struggle of um, how they manage the club. I think now is um, is a bit change, it's a bit change, and uh, it's a good change. With all these new, uh, kit launch videos, you know, they can really market themselves is in a proper way in a better way which the merchandise plays big role in a club's financial you know they generate sales they generate income for every club in the world so it's important and it's important for us Malaysian to support the product as well so let's see who have the best kit launch video let's go Talk like a king. You can act around now, say the same thing. They chasing the fame, they all want the name. The they ain't got what's running through these veins. Make way for the king. Twenty twenty is the new year for TFC with new players new coaches philosophy, the new stadium and the full support from the best fans. You will rise again. Are you ready for the new beginning? But hey, why so serious? Of course, we need a new jersey.
kerana kami adalah masa hadapan. The future is now. Okay, personally, I think all the videos is very good. All right. So as a football fans, I really wish that there are more proper investment, proper club management that can go into all these clubs. Our Malaysian football league future is bright, definitely. You know, we just need proper guy. You know, I'm not disrespecting the current, you know, people that are running football clubs or local football clubs. I'm not. I'm just I just mean that we need you know better better structure we need to improve you know financially wise you know marketing wise you know whatever it is as a whole we need to improve you know as the future is there we as a Malaysian you know some Malaysian football fans is really crazy we love football a lot you know but the young supper really young minat pula sepak ni dia orang tahu lah apa yang diorang fikir apa yang diorang harap yang uh, akan berubah di uh, sukan bola sepak Malaysia ni especially Liga Malaysia ni apa yang boleh diperbaiki apa yang boleh uh, di uh, di ubah suai untuk kebaikan uh, untuk kemajuan bola sepak Malaysia ni so that's about it you know if this topic is good i think i will continue in my next episode and I don't mind talk about any other sports or any other things but um, I think at the moment I will stick with football because I'm one of the very very crazy football fans thank you guys remember stay home stay safe